This is a Safaspi MMA 160 welder. It costs less than a fancy dinner for two. And the company actually reached out to me and asked if I would give an honest review if they sent this to me. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. Will it weld, will it last, or will it fry itself when I turn the switch on? Let's find out. All right, so let's talk about what I like and what I don't like, starting with what I like. It's crazy affordable, it's dual voltage, it's portable, it's simple to use, you literally just plug it in, it registers whether it's 110 or 220, you set your amps and you start welding. Let's talk about what I don't like. The ground clamp and stinger are pretty much what you would expect at this price point. They're not the greatest, but they're not the worst. They work. When I first struck up, it did trip my breaker. I did have to go reset that. I don't know if that was my fault or if it was the machine's fault, but that was an issue. So, is this a Fosby MMA 160 worth it? Honestly, if you have under $100 and you're looking for a cheap welder to get the job done, or you're new, and you're looking for a welder that you can practice with without breaking the bank. Honestly, yeah. It's not a professional welder. It works, and that alone sets it apart from other gear on Amazon. So if you want something that's cheap and ultra portable, I'll drop a link in the description below and you can check this out for yourself.